Freddy wants that sound It's a musical car It's the hit sensation across the nation With an up-and-coming star You see me riding every day I'm never too far It's just a musical car Hello, you're watching Jeff's Musical Car in Moncton, and this week I have Peterborough, Ontario's May Hemingways. So thanks for coming along, guys. Awesome, thanks, Jeff. Yeah. It was a it was a short notice one. I was at home. I was like, Hey, you want to take a spin in my car, play some music? They're like, We're in. <laughs> yeah, An hour yeah, later, exactly. here we are. Yeah, worked out. Yeah, glad to be here. So, um, can you tell me a bit about the group? Uh, I find it interesting, just all the instruments you can bring to a show with a two piece. Is this? Uh, something that was planned from the start or did you just end up writing songs that kind of went with uh, different uh, instruments? Um, yeah, I don't think it was very planned. Yeah, it just kind of happened. I think I was playing these instruments for a long time in previous That's bands, true, yeah. Sort yeah. of. Yeah, um, Ben sort of had like the, the knowledge and the skill on them so it kind of just made sense to yeah. make yeah, it eclectic. Yeah, this band and sort of let it become more multi-instrumental I don't I think yeah yeah yes. because but it wasn't planned it just mm -hmm. it was like it just variety way, let's yeah. make a variety here so. yeah yeah exactly yeah because you know a whole show of one instrument can be with two guys can we probably make it work but yeah. it's nice to have that eclectic uh, nature and stuff yeah and especially you get the the casual walking at a bar mm -hmm. and they'll they're used to seeing the two guys up there with guitar singing but yeah, yeah. as soon as you start mixing it up you pull the accordion out and the banjo and totally. then people, it kind of catches people's eye that's yeah. a big thing we try to do too you know it, it just kind of happens as a, as a big sound for two guys like mm. um you just hear that a lot because bench plays bass with his feet as well so yeah kind of fills in the low end and, and it, yeah it sounds like a lot more than the sum of its parts which is kind of something we strive to do you know mm -hmm. and, it, and it makes it easier on touring the, <laughs> with the two piece yeah obviously yeah exactly you can kind of, kind of fill a night somewhere yourself or you know mm -hmm. Um, do a variety of shows, so yeah, yeah. it's fun. So uh, tell me about a bit about your uh, latest album, Hun Hunter Street Blues. How's that been going? Um, it's been good. It's mm -hmm. just been out for about a month now, yeah. and uh, we finally got the final copies like two days ago. Yeah, <laughs> right so before tour. Yes, just, uh, you still have the new. We're uh, just trying to get smell. rid of it yeah. now. New album smell for so, sure. Uh, yeah. Please. Uh, purchase it let's <laughs> get rid of it yeah yeah no it, it was cool it. We, we did it out in alberta in october and it, it just you know it takes a long time to mix and sure. and duplicate and stuff so uh it's been great we've had like some a little bit of chart stuff with campus radio and, and mm -hmm. community radio which is cool yeah you know it's nice to people are playing it out there so okay. just, now we're just getting out there to uh to get it to the people you know basically yeah. Yeah. And, and while we're talking about the album uh, i'm assuming you're gonna play a track off that album Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Which totally. one? Which one are you gonna do? Can you tell me about it? About yeah. it? All this tone bomb. It's uh, just. It's actually a kind of older song of mine that details uh, when I used to work at this place, an uh, all night uh, sort of breakfast, like donut. Yeah. Yeah, donut shop. That's what it was. Yeah. It was, it was a like donut a... shop. That, Breakfast, I guess. Yeah, it was sort of. Uh, it was grimy, but awesome at the same time. <laughs> you know? Yeah, every town has one of those. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So, uh, yeah. yeah, it's, it's gone a now. Song about an incident that happened there one time, I guess. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Well, without any spoilers, we'll we'll go right into the song. All right, sure. sure. Let's, do Let's do it. Yeah.
my best, but there was nothing in your eyes. It's too hard, Christmas. The cops are called, and you went home. To the drunk time, to the warm. They'll let you ride so you can go. Stuff. Yeah. Good acoustics right. in this car. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Specially designed. <laughs> yeah. yeah. The, your um, your music definitely uh, vies well in the, in the Atlantic provinces. This is kind of uh, an East Coast sound. A lot of your songs that I was listening to. So I'm sure when you're on the on tour around here, it's not a it's not a genre of music that people aren't used to hearing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I think. So. I think with people. The accordion, yeah, sure. with the accordion for sure. Yeah, I think uh, I think people like to hear. Uh, like a, something that touches on familiar, but is, is different too. You know what I mean? Yeah. Just bit nice. of bit, bit of kitchen party. And yeah, 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 yeah. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And when you guys uh, hit the road, does it feel more like home when you visit places like Moncton and, and other places along the way? Yeah, I, th I think so for sure. It's really nice to have like good friends and mm -hmm. you know people you've known for quite a few years now. You know, it makes a big difference. Um, some places, yeah, you meet people really quick. Other places, you know, it's uh, not so much. But here, it's yeah. It, it does make a big difference. Yeah, takes away some of that road loneliness when you, yeah. when you kind of have some familiar faces in each spot. Yeah, totally, exactly, and catch up with people and see how they're doing, and mm -hmm. and you know, talk lots about ourselves to them, I guess. Yeah. Talk <laughs> if music, they want, whatever. You know. <laughs> yeah, talk music. Yeah. Yeah, that's great. Well, yeah. I'm gonna get you guys back to the venue. Uh, thanks for coming along, cool. and thanks, Jeff. Hope to uh, see you guys back in Moncton soon again. Yeah, right on. Yeah. Sounds good, man. Yeah. Thank you. So thanks. that was uh, May Hemingways. Be sure to check them out if you see them in your town or city. And that's it for this episode of Jeff's Musical Car. See you next time.